Hello, welcome to our video. This is a video to help you if you are having difficulties downloading from Google Play. So if you've gone to Google Play and getting an error similar to this, error downloading from Google, and you may have an error similar to this, this will hopefully help you solve that problem. Now, you can download some links from the description of this video. You can download the files that I'm going to be using to fix this. Or I may have sent you a memory card with the files on it. Either way, the file, if you downloaded the files, download the files, put them on the root of your memory card, navigate to your memory card. Now, if I've given you a memory card, go to the memory card, the SD card here. So if I go back one more time. So we go to file manager here. We go, we'll be starting off with here. Go to the SD card. All the files are on here that you need. Now the first thing that we need to do is root the phone. So you install this app here called Framer Root. Click that. Now it will give you this install blocked. Go to settings. Tick the unknown sources. Go back. Go back to Framer Root. Install. You might get an option just decline that like I did. Now you can see it's installed. I'll go to open. Now what I need to do is select up here install super SU and then I want to do the second option the barra here down here. Okay. It'll say success super installed a uh, super user installed press OK and reboot the device. Now I will reboot the device but before I do that I want to install another app. So I go to file manager again, navigate to the SD card. Now I want to install this mobile uncle to toolbox. So I do the same thing again. Next, next. Install. Let's decline that. And that's it. We won't open that yet. So now we reboot the phone. Right, once we've rebooted the phone, we want to do one more step. So we go to File Manager. Now we go to the folder that says Recovery. Now we click that Recovery IMG, just keep your finger on it until you get this sort of menu. I want to do that which copies it. So that is now holding that as a copy. I go back and back once more and then go to the phone storage here. Now from here I want to paste it so I want to do this icon down here to paste. Okay now that's pasted on there. I can go back to the home, go to the app tray and now we want to open mobile uncle tools. Now it will ask you if you want to give it super user permission you must grant it. So press a grant and now that we're in there we want to go to the recovery update. So that option there, click that. And we've copied that recovery update onto um, the phone. So it'll probably find the update on here. So it's actually found it on my um, SD card, but you may have it on the internal storage. So that recovery IMG, I want to click that. And it says, do you want to replace it? So I go to OK and wait for it to update and it says it's done it. Now what I want to do is reboot into recovery mode. Now this has changed the recovery of the phone. So it will reboot into this touch recovery. You'll see a menu like this. Now what I want to do is a restore. Go to the restore here and then you'll see if you don't see this, by the way, um, you will need to go to the storage. So if you don't see this um, this option when you go straight into it, you'll need to change the storage to SD card rather than EMMC, which is the internal storage. So go to the SD card, go back. Now you should see this option here, that this update here, or this backup. Click that backup, you'll see these three crosses leave them as they are. What you'll need to do now is to restore this backup that I've made with the files all fixed. So just go across there and it will update the phone. OK, 
give it some time. Now once it's updated I will get this option down here, reboot system. So now I know it's fully updated I can safely click this reboot, reboot system. My phone then will start up. So once it's started up you will notice um, there's a few more apps on here. Um, there's a flashlight app, uh, there's ES File Explorer and um, it's there's this uninstall option as well. Now the uninstall option lets you uninstall apps but it also lets you do the super user because it also lets you uninstall some root applications. Now be careful of this because if you uninstall root applications like here, key module here, your phone may stop working. So I would avoid that um, and try not to use it um, to uninstall uh, a root app accidentally. Okay, so now if we go into the Google Play Store, so once you sign back into the Google Play Store, um, we can try and download an app. So let's try and download this app here. So we can just go to install, accept. You can see it's downloading there. Once it's downloading, we'll open it and see if it all works. You can see that you're not going to have this problem anymore. The Google Play has been updated to the latest Google Play along with the Google Play services, so you should be fine now. So you can just see, I've opened it now and the app started up and it's all fully downloaded properly. So anyway, I hope this uh, video has helped you. Um, thanks very much for watching. If you found this helpful, please like the video, share our videos, comment on the comments below and most importantly make sure you subscribe to our videos. Thanks for watching this video.